morning friends it is sunday morning and i am gonna go for a trail ride winter is here or fall late fall so there's a lot of snow in places it's cold it's rainy right now it isn't raining though so i am going to cook up breakfast and then pack up salsa and we are going to hit the trail now this trail that i'm going on isn't a marked trail isn't like a public trail it's on county road or county land so i am not going to disclose the location just because a lot so the trail that we're going on today is a biking like dirt biking motorbike trail that a lot of people use in the spring and summertime and nobody really goes up there in the winter time so i'm gonna head up there with salsa and i'm going to bring winston along my little westie I don't know where he's at right now so I don't really know. I know one section of the trail is about two miles long. We've done that before with our dogs, but I've never jumped over the road because it crosses the road and it goes further up. So I haven't done that part of the trail. So we're gonna just hop on it and see how far it goes and it should be fun. I'm also gonna take a little bit of time and actually film like my tacking up process. So this will kind of be like a tack up and ride with me type of video because I know that those are kind of fun to watch so I will be doing that. Out salsa in the trailer I just need to go grab Winston and then we can be on our way. Okay so we made it to the trailhead and I am just going to get salsa unloaded and tacked up and then we'll be on our way. So we're on the trail. Salsa is doing great. Oops, just kind of hit. And Winston is going to learn a lesson real quick, not to stand too closely behind the horse. So got to work on that. But very nice footing. It's a little slick, but that's to be expected on a fall ride. Making sure to make a lot of noise because I think we're the only ones out here. And I'd like to scare off as many critters as possible. I see a lot of elk tracks on the trail, but it's a great ride so far. I'm really digging it. What do you think, Winston? You're gonna get kicked, sir. Gotta work on that. It's very beautiful. I think this trail is primarily used for dirt biking, but... I don't know, I've never seen dirt bikers up here. I know that there's a staging staging area down below, so I don't know, they might come through here, they might not. But great ride so far. Yep, Salsa's having a good time. There's a little chipmunk, very exciting. Going through a nice little spooky part of the forest here. It's actually showing up a lot lighter on the camera, but it's pretty dark in here. Good girl, Salsa. Salsa's doing great. She's got a lot of muscle tone built up from the couple rides that we've done, so she is rocking it. She's a little wary of puddles, but you know, we'll work on that. We got this, right Winston? <laughs> he is a little turkey. Okay, so typically this is a clearing and you can kind of see the whole valley right here. But it looks like we're kind of above the clouds. And Mount Hood is like over here. You can't really see it because it has a bunch of cloud coverage. I'm really glad that we did this trail. I almost went on Mount Hood, but it would have been really cloudy. So this is definitely, can't beat this view. Okay, so you can kind of see, whoa, how steep the trail is here. 
So you just definitely have to be careful with those non-seasoned trail horses and make sure that they are placing their feet correctly on the trail. But man, this is, oh, I know, this is so beautiful. Just gorgeous. And you can sometimes see Mount Adams along the valley here when it's clear, but you know, again, it is a little bit cloudy. So we did some trailblazing. We kind of went to the top of this bluff here. It's really cool. I think we got our Christmas tree up here one year. So we found this creek area. Still on the logging road. We're still trailblazing. And I think we're gonna turn around here. Good girl, Salsa. She did great. Winston's doing good. You tired, Winst? So we are nearing the end of the trail. Going through some leaves here. We're almost back to the truck and trailer where we left it. We've gone about four and a half miles, but I did find out where that trail goes that we were on for a while because I didn't want to go through that kind of more like dark and secluded area or part of it. It actually like goes down and then up onto this peak and then across the the hill which is really nice. So I think we're gonna do that next time because that looks like a great trail. And I mean not that this hasn't been a good trail but we've been kind of on on the road for a little bit here. So We'll probably go all the way up it and then back down it just for footing purposes. But Winston's been having a ball. He's on the chipmunk hunt. He hasn't gotten anything because he's not that quick. <laughs> but he likes to chase him. Vincel's is doing good here. Definitely trying to avoid the rocks. She doesn't have any shoes on, but we do have boots on her, so. Her hooves are protected. Did see some motorbikes. Two guys came up and passed us. Salsa did great. Winston did great. I haven't seen Salsa around a dirt bike before, so it was really cool to see how she would react because I've had her around bicycles, four wheelers, mules, you name it. And she's been really awesome, but I wasn't sure about dirt bikes. So we can check that one off the list so she doesn't spook at dirt bikes. So. Just an all around good girl. So we've got the little dog and the big grass dog all loaded up and we're heading home. We just made it home and now I'm going to get salsa out. She's very excited that we're home. Very sweaty. Actually not too bad, but let's get her unloaded. Alright, so I got Salsa unloaded, I got Winston unloaded, got the trailer off of the truck, and we are done for the day. That was a really awesome trail ride. We went about five, five and a half miles, but very successful, had a great time, and it only started raining like a teeny bit while we were going. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye! Junis. Little turkey. But look at that. That's a scene. Oh.